I want to argue that the kind of charter of rights that is proposed for Australia falls between two stools. It neither provides effective direct remedies for Australian citizens who have their rights infringed, nor does it give them anything else. The claim in favour of it is that it will create a culture of rights. My view is that the model proposed for Australia, because it involves judges to the extent it does, will produce a culture of rights where the understandings of rights are unnecessarily dominated by legal concerns. And I'd like to see a more robust, more revisable, more interesting, more dynamic and potentially radical concept of rights emerge from our political debate rather than the pale and legalised form that I fear we'll get under an Australian Charter of Rights.